So I want to set up an online resource for our ESL students in traditional classes to access activities and possibly ESL series that align with the core curriculum in the class that they're taking. Um, and I'm hoping that this will be um, something that students who cannot make it to all of their classes, who have frequent absences, or who cannot attend a full class period, will be able to access in order to make up work that they would have otherwise missed, or just for students in, in traditional classes who, um, who would like to do extra homework. So I will work with the ESL teachers um, to do this, and I got a great idea from Farzana. She said, why don't you, instead of having a bunch of different links attached to our school website, she said, why don't you just have it all attached, uh, all of it on a wiki and have the wiki linked to our school website. So every time I need to add a new activity or I find a new link, I don't need to go through the school website. I can just go to my own wiki. So thank you, Farzana, for that idea. <laughs> Hi, um, oh, I learned a great thing from uh, um, Heather was that um, she started to um, implement a book called Inside America to uh, to be able to use um, online you know, for the students to use it online. And she said it's, it was 13 chapters, but um, she has started already actually. And um, that uh, th there was one uh, thing that she mentioned was that there were some stories. Um, uh, one story in particular was um, something about baby shower in America, the culture of America. So, and she said there were, you know, um, the picture was um, about the 80s and their hairstyle and their clothing and stuff like that. But our time nowadays, we have you know those digital camera and the modern style and all these things. So our baby shower is so much different from the old time of 18, 19, 80s, 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 90s. 80s, 90s. Well, not that different, but uh, somewhat different. So then I said, well, why don't we? Um, even though I suggested her, actually, I like the, you know I think we should do that too. That we will we should ask the students to take pictures with their own digital camera of the baby shower. You know the current baby showers that. They have been to and then compare those pictures and see what they can you know come up with and you know they can write essay or short paragraphs or stuff like that so thank you Heather for teaching thank you <laughs>